Here we go. Good morning, everybody. It is moving day. I don't know why I'm doing a full face of makeup on moving day. Whatever gets you through, right? But yeah, it is finally the day. I am moving into my new flat. The movers have literally just pulled up outside. They are looking for somewhere to park. Good luck, hun. Good luck. I need to put mascara on and fix my eyeliner. Botched my eyeliner, as always. I thought I'd bring you along, as always. I don't think there's really been a move that I haven't documented in some way. So yeah, welcome to my fourth moving series. Yeah, I'm gonna bring you around, show you the old place. There's a house tour of the old place if you do wanna see that. And then I'll show you what the new place looks like empty as well. How pretty is the light in here though? I will miss this, I have to say. It makes the most lovely glow, so nice. There they are. This room's all done. All ready to go. Apart from the Christmas tree. The movers are in. Should have, I'd say, a couple of hours. And then I reckon we'll be in. We're all boxed up almost. Fan number one, got van number two on the corner. So this is all coming to the new place. And then we've got another van for stuff that's going to my family. Here we go. Oh, I love this bedroom. It's a state right now, but it's been a good room to me. Bag and shoe room, office. It's weird it being this empty. I haven't seen it like this in ages. So much space. You should have had a party here, Lois. Lois's last place of residence. <laughs> They've left the chair until last just for you. I haven't put you in the naughty corner, by the way. She gets really cold. <laughs> We're in. Sorry, the spinning is going to really bug me. So this is my living room. I'm going to give you a little wee tour. Okay, so this is from the corner. Hey. <laughs> I've got a pillar here. It's just... I kind of like the pillar. It's growing on me. <laughs> yes, this is my kitchen and living room area. So, so nice. I've already got the internet installed and bought a tiny Christmas tree, as you can see outside. I do plan on Christmasifying my balcony. Very excited about that. So that's the living room. I've got a bedroom here, which is gonna be my bedroom. Wardrobes. There's my bathroom. Love this bathroom. I've never had a nice bathroom before, so I'm excited about that. This is the other bedroom with more wardrobes. So yeah, this is what it looks like down here. Nice big space there. And then my slippers, which have been here for ages for when I have to sit in here and wait for people. And then utility room. I'm very excited to organize my cleaning products. Um, and then there's the rest of the hallway. Very, very excited to get all my stuff in here, finally. Finally. Just didn't need the space at the old place. Like, it's just, Rattling around. I think we've got enough pizza. <laughs> you can eat some pizza that looks like I mean, that's not exactly out of the ordinary for me normally. Mm -hmm. We are getting there. Lois has got the funnest job in the world. <laughs> Untangling fairy lights. Got a mirror up, my TV stand. I mean, nothing is plugged in yet. I'm gonna get my brother to come around and sort all of these wires and stuff out because I don't know where, what's going where. Works on the internet, doesn't know how to do any of this. I feel like I did try and learn at the start of the year when I got this TV because I came back from Miami and there was no TV, which was really <laughs> It was really weird walking into a house. It's like, what are you pointing at your furniture at? You don't own a TV. What's all your furniture pointed at? <laughs> but yeah, so we're getting somewhere. I'm very happy. Everything fits so far, which I'm really impressed with because we thought this sofa was going to be a bit touch and go and it wouldn't quite fit in this space. But actually, it, I think it's perfect. Like, it's not too... The other guy, that the, there was a guy that lived here before and his sofa was, like, a little bit too small. I need to find the other set of... I don't know where the other set of... Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> this is what you get to the point of... <laughs> I swear, when you move, you do, like, you get to a point in the afternoon where you're just like, I can't function anymore. It and it, but it's silly, because I don't really do that much. I, like, I use smooth movers and they're like the best, 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 best movers ever. I've literally used them for every single move, even like when I was 21 and I moved out of my parents' house. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I used them then. And I just love them so much, they're the best. I feel like I said this last year when I moved. Best I team. I definitely use them now, because I hate packing. And because they're really cute as well. Yeah, they're really, really cute. <laughs> they all have girlfriends. <laughs> they all have girlfriends, I was just like, 
damn it. <laughs> he was like, yeah, I won't, I won't give that to my girlfriend. And I was like, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> it's that Phoebe right there. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Basically we put all my clothes in this room ready for me to sort out. <laughs> that is that is a project for another day, my friends. Not today. What is that room? <laughs> the second room. Yeah, I was like, no. Not today. Day. <laughs> yeah, that will be a day's work. Yeah. Cause it'll be like, there's so many clothes and so many like little bits. I've got a lot of work to do. I was planning on just having a chilled evening tonight and I was like, okay, first night in the new place, I'm gonna watch the holiday and like Love Actually and watch all the nice Christmassy films that I haven't had a chance to watch yet. And I'm gonna watch all of The Apprentice that I've missed over the past few weeks. I've been working like a mad woman and moving like a mad woman. No, because I, I forgot, that I don't know how to wire that. <laughs> It's not the same. I, I need to kind of wrap up here and then go back to the old house and clean. It's gonna be my exercise for the day. Woo, so happy. No, actually I'm, re I'm really happy. <laughs> Genuinely really happy. Yeah, I've got an hour until I need to be back there, so fun times. is the skincare. This is the worst bit about moving. There we go. Yes. Okay, flannels. Ooh, bingo. Yes. I'm in, I'm officially in. I have run all of my errands that I need to run this evening. I'm not picking my nose, by the way, I'm taking my nose to that. Had to go to my mum and dad's tonight. There was something that got dropped there that was kind of meant to go around the corner. So I had to just go and move it because my mum was like, Oh my god, there's other stuff in my house. And I also went and popped in to see Danny as well and give her her, her boss the hoodie. I'm so tired, I can't speak, but it was lovely to see her and really catch up quite quickly because I'll see her on Friday in a couple of days time, but it will be here and there's gonna be a few people here. So I won't get to like have a little like chilled sit down catch up. So it's nice to just go see her, cuddle beanie. I love beanie, it's so cute. That was my day. I'm hoping tomorrow will be a little bit more chilled. We're kind of winding up down for Christmas now a little bit. Me and the rest of the world, working world, I feel like, or my working world, which is good because although there's still like a lot of stuff going on, it's just not as mental. So tomorrow I have like a nice day planned. It's like a looking after myself kind of day, doing all the things I haven't done in like a month that I really needed to do. So I'm um, really looking forward to that. I like to have every sort of just have a day on my, I'm gonna sort my life out. And I really do need to start sorting my life out because I've got a lot of stuff to unpack. I really probably will need clothes at some point. So I do really need to unpack. So I'm gonna make a start on that. Can't wait to have everything in my wardrobes and just all like set out, hoping everything fits everywhere that it should. I've never downsized before, so. I wasn't sure if I was gonna be able to fit into this flat. So I've fitted quite nicely so far, fingers crossed, into two bedrooms instead of three, which is great. But I really did feel like it was completely unnecessary having such a big house just for me. I did always feel as though like there was a family that probably would have benefited from living there more, which I think is the case now, which is good. It just feels more right being here. Oh god, I need to take my ponytail out. It's so heavy. I can feel it pulling on my hairline. If I've got fluff around here, by the way, I don't just grow black fluff. It's from my hoodie, obviously. It feels really good to be in here. So I will probably, at the end of the week, maybe, once everything is all where it should be, I'll probably do a wee house tour, a flat tour. I've got to go back to the same flat now. I don't spend a lot of time at home anymore, so everything in it is quite, like, there's not a lot of stuff, but I really like that. It's actually, I think it's gonna be really nice to have less and just to come home and have a clear space that I can really relax in because I did just start to find my old place really overwhelming. I like mentally for me, it just stressed me out all the time. And this has been really, really good for me. So very happy, very happy to be here. So that is me done. I am gonna go to bed now, very, very tired. I'm so looking forward to sleep. I am gonna go to bed now and I'll see you in the morning. Bye. Good morning, 
So today I get my extensions in. I have a couple of hours until I need to be at the hairdressers. I actually have an hour and a half until I need to drop stuff into the office for Lois. So I'm going to be in a little bit of a rush this morning, but I've decided to not rush. <laughs> I've just made myself a cup of tea. It's Christmas, I'm not rushing anything. I don't actually know where any of my coats are. TBC on what I'm wearing today. Bingo. Okay, outfit of the day featuring some cardboard box mess. This is pretty much the best I could do. Trying to make an outfit when you can't find half of your clothes is really difficult. So I am wearing the same body as yesterday, but I've got my Topshop Sydney jeans. That's what they are, my Topshop. Sydney jeans, my Topshop aviator jacket. My body is also from Topshop, I believe. No, actually it was ASOS. And then I've got Topshop boots on. It's just kind of like a very wintry day outside and I was just feeling the like all black. And so I don't know what I'm doing with my hair when I have like the tapings put in. So this outfit's kind of like a universal, whatever hair I have done will kind of go with it. So yeah, it's also very, very cold at the moment. So I can just kind of like snuggle up. This is my favorite thing to do with these jackets. It's just like hold it up to my chin. <laughs> yeah, that is today's outfit. Oh, and then I've got my Fendi bag. Yeah. my new hair in. I'm very excited about this. Yeah, I can just go to bed with long hair and wake up with long hair. It's gonna be the world's biggest time saver. and a demolished burger. I just love it when I've had my hair done and it's raining. Happy, happy times. I'm home. I'm so happy to be home. It was so grim and rainy outside. I really, really hate being rained on. Yeah, that's kind of what they are looking like. Obviously have just been rained on. So I, in general, don't look fantastic <laughs> Now my makeup's like halfway down my face. Very much looking forward to taking my makeup off right now, I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, that's the kind of deal with the extensions. I've had tapins put in, so I literally have never had such a flat head. I've never been able to wear my extensions and have like no bumps so this is just amazing the best bit about tapes when you get them done really well they basically stay flat to your head which is so cool so i don't look like i have a giant head with all of this hair in, get a thicker result on the end without being like i'm gonna be playing with this until the end of time now but it's quite nice because now i just can get home and i don't have to worry about taking extensions out or anything like that yeah that's fab very very happy with them so yeah that is uh my hair bathroom still looks a mess bedroom still looks like utter chaos i need to sort this tomorrow it's really stressing me out i've still got boxes boxes so yeah i think i'm gonna have a day tomorrow where i just sort everything out go through all the boxes my priority is to kind of get my beauty storage and my wardrobe done because those are the bits that i'm going to need to use the most and i just really need to get that done i need to get dressed girl needs clothes i don't know where my tops are so i can't wear that black body again for another day it's just that's not okay so i'm gonna need to to find my tops because i found trousers so i was like bingo coats fab yeah i need to have a drink get ready for bed I am very, very, very tired and I've got a lot of stuff to sort out tomorrow. I really want to have everything done in here by Friday because I'm having all my friends around to show them the new flat and I don't want there to still be boxes around. There's still boxes there. 
I'm really, really happy to be here. Tomorrow, I'm packing random house admin. Fun times, I'm gonna go to the gym as well. I am probably gonna end this vlog here. I really hope that this was interesting. It feels like this vlog has kind of been a bit chaotic just because the past couple of days have been so, so mentally busy. But I think tomorrow will be really like nice and chill and I can just kind of like vlog and focus on my shiz. And yeah, I'm excited to just be starting afresh and have some time off and just balance myself out a bit because I feel like the past three months of this year I just haven't stopped. I'm just not really feeling like myself. Even when I vlog at the moment, I'm not really feeling like myself. So I'm really, really excited to just get my shits together. Yeah, I'm going to get ready for bed. And I will see you guys again in a couple of days for the next moving vlog. Bye.